some some sort of special edition resto mod or, or just mod rebuilt 996 like something like that but like the next step further you know where, where the you know reinforced where it needs to be just stripped down to the bare metal and, and turned into a brand new car with let's say they they put a, a Metzger engine in it but good morning everyone or should I say it's a great morning because today <laughs> the PCA the Porsche Club of America announced that they made a one of one 996 generation Porsche 911 resto mod and I predicted this. I can't believe that I was actually right about this. And, I, you know, I could pat myself on the back all I want, but I guess this was sort of like obvious that this was coming. But I've, I've been in, in videos after videos asking for this, like demanding that somebody step up and, and build this because I'm not in the position to do so right now, but when I'm older, I, I want to do that to my to my car, I, and I distinctly remember saying in, in my uh, I think this was two two or three videos ago, my 964 generation comparison to the 996 in, in terms of values video, um, where I said that someone should build a 996 resto mod like Singer or one of these things. I didn't think that the, the that Porsche Classic would be the one to do it, but where you take a 996 an early build because they're the the coveted ones of for some reason. I think I even mentioned the ducktail and everything. Like you put the GT3 front splitter and side skirts, and then the the ducktail on the back, and uh, <laughs> give it a Mesger motor. Make sure it's got a six speed, and then rebuild the interior with some nice stitching, and boom. And that's literally what the Porsche Club of America has done with this this classic coupe. I mean, the, I think the one detail I missed out on was um, Porsche Porsche Club gray. But wow, I, this is great. So, all right, let's get into the details a bit. Porsche Club of America announced the Porsche 911 Classic Club Coupe, a 996 generation 911 Carrera that received a nut and bolt restoration, which included one of a kind modifications to enhance the sports car's appearance and performance. And this is what I've been wanting for ever since I bought my car a year and a half ago. This is like, I have been waiting for somebody to make this car, like this exact car. For, for so long, ever since I saw a singer and, and then I saw that, then I bought my 996, I was like, someone needs to buy, this. someone needs to do this because it's, it's just a sin that it doesn't <laughs> exist yet. And you know, like, like I said, you could, you could go out and you can get a, uh, yeah, the, the Evos that they have in, in, uh, in England, but that there's nothing like as an equivalent here. And Porsche Club of America took it the next step above to sort of bring in the culmination of all the best bits of the 996 and and to be honest even 997 because uh, because yeah they like you know one of them is better than the other in my opinion but <laughs> so yeah uh, they they basically just took the Carrera body beefed it up with the the chassis stiffening and and um, and suspension of the GT3 put the GT3 motor in it and uh, yeah they uh, they also added some really nice details. Um, on the, of the ducktail and um, just the the whole aero package is, is is great. It's like the best of the GT3 without having the the taco wing, and um, the double bubble roof is also pretty cool in my opinion. I look, I just think this is this is beautiful. I'll, I'll put pictures up, and then of course the interior. You know all the best bits of 996. You know they have the the special houndstooth stitching in the centers of the 996 sports seats, which by the way, even 993 owners put in their cars because the 996, the 996 sports seats are, are some of the best seats Porsche ever made. And yeah, and, and yeah, it started life as a normal 99 Carrera. And I, I just wanted to make this shorter video today to talk about how I've been, I've been waiting for this for so long. I've spoken about it in the past. I knew it was coming. And I hope that it's not just limited to one model because me personally, when I get older and, and can afford to, to do something like that to my car, I, I hope that, that the resources are, or I hope that there's something out there that, that is that. I hope that this continues to be built. I would love to have to turn my car into that. And um, yeah, you know, whether it's Singer, Gunther Works, any of these people that, that take the 996 platform and turn it into something really special like that. I I foresee that happening and I think that this is the first step in sort of that becoming a thing. Like, And the fact that Porsche Classic, the factory themselves, were the first ones to do it, 
uh, you know, besides England, but, but we're the first ones to really properly make something like this, gives me hope that that will exist. So let me know you guys' thoughts in the comments below. Let me know whether, if you are a 996 owner or if you're planning to be, whether you're interested in something like this existing, whether you would be interested in, in turning your car into one of these, and, um, and if you agree with me on the fact that this was sort of a, this is sort of the first step in many of these, you know, resto modded 996 based platform things, um, cars. If you agree with it, you know, if you if this is something that you think was the right thing for, for them to do, and if you're surprised also that it was Porsche Classic themselves that, that did it, so let me know below, and uh, I, I look forward to reading your comments because this is this is really exciting to me, <laughs> and um, I can't believe I was right. So yeah, I'll see you in the next one, and for now, have a good one. Bye, camera.